Hi, Somerville High School. I'd like to talk to you about our upcoming lockdown training drill, which will happen on Tuesday, November 15th. It'll happen sometime before lunch. We want to practice our lockdown drills so they become second nature, much like we do fire drills. The lockdown drill is really an integral part of keeping all of our students safe in the event of a situation that requires us to go into lockdown. We'll be practicing two types of lockdowns. First, I want to take this opportunity to say that lockdowns is an example of why we really make sure all of our students have IDs. In the split seconds when a lockdown is called, our staff is going to have to make very quick decisions about who belongs in a building and who doesn't. And if everybody is wearing an ID, it makes that job simpler and much smoother. We will be practicing two types of lockdowns. The first one will be a lockdown with intruder. That is a situation where the threat is inside the building. A threat is detected or an incident has happened inside of Somerville High School. Students and staff will seek shelter behind locked doors and become silent and as invisible as possible. Once the announcement is made, the police then respond and take control of the entire situation. We will explain that more when we walk through the drill itself on Tuesday, November 19th. The second type of lockdown is a secure and hold situation. That is when the threat is outside of the building. The police notify the school that there is a threat in the area of the high school. The school doors are locked and no one is allowed in or out of the building. All schedule activities will continue. At that point, the principal, myself, would be in control of the building and control any movement. We may, if there's a secure and hold, have passing to the next class. We may not. The situation will dictate that. During a secure and hold situation, the principal or my designee would be in constant contact with the police and public safety officials. Those are the two drills we'll be practicing. We really want to make sure that all of our students and all of our staff are safe given any situation that could occur. So on Tuesday, November 15th, I will make an announcement that we will begin our lockdown training drills. I will walk us through a series of steps and we will all follow them, both types of lockdowns that we'll do. During the drill, I will be reading from a script that takes us step by step through each drill. Each drill will end and will be concluded with what will happen in the event of an actual lockdown and we will make an announcement that that lockdown training is finished and we will move to the next one. At the end of the second drill, we will resume our normal daily activities on November 15th. These are two drills that we'll be doing throughout the year. In the event that we have to go into a lockdown, we all know the proper steps and it becomes second nature to everyone. Thank you.